Up next, board vacancies. about what bankruptcy means and does in large corporations. He's a dog on good trial lawyer as well. I'd rep recommend him for the lawyer representative vacancy. And I would just like to add that, and I read his resume, and I'm glad to have a lawyer, but when we're out there trying to find people, a lot of our audits are not in the typical audit. I just come in and look at your books, the operational <coughs> audits. And so we need somebody with a and, um, not a familiarity with operational audits, but the, we also need somebody that thinks operational. Uh, and I would move that we move Mr. Funk forward. Very good. Basic consensus there? Very nice. All right. Um, I think I have somebody for the vacancy on the MPO. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm totally. Shay has a situation here. Go ahead. <laughs> We have one vacancy on the MPO, which is an alternate member vacancy. Um, thank you if you have someone to. I'm talking to you tomorrow. Okay. Um, land use has. Um, oops, I'm sorry. Mr. Chair, uh, they changed their time, meeting time. That is a factor uh, for some. So um, I'll give you a call, but uh, <coughs> just so that you know it's no longer on that Thursday date, it's a 9 30 till. The MPO. Right. The 9.30 till 10.30. At least 11. 11. 9.30 till 11. On Thursday. First Thursday? Yeah, I think that's right. I don't have this, it right before. This I week. I thought it started at 9. It starts at 9.30. I think it's 9. The it's executive is 8.15 and the regulars at 9. At 9. Yeah. Okay. Starts at 9. Thank you, Dr. Newbill. PDC, yeah. This is MPO. Oh. Yeah, MPO not. The next um, vacancy is for Central Virginia Waste Management Authority, and these are land use recommendations. Kevin White, he's filling the alternate vacancy. Let me just go through all of. We must be doing good with lawyer Kevin's today. All right. The next any, one. Oh, okay. Any problem with that? Very good. Moving on. The next one is for GRTC, uh, Greater Richmond Transit Company. And we have George Braxton to fill the vacancy on the board. Who was in the seat? Um, it was um, Linda Brody Myers. And she was yeah, this in which she was She was out of All right. But Braxton is a reappointment. No. Bryson is a new member. He's been. Oh, I'm looking at this thing here. It says reappointment. Oh, it's a it's supposed to be important. Okay, thank you. Sorry. All right. Okay, so new. Yeah. Any objections to Mr. Braxton? Wonderful. So we move him forward as well. The River Forestry Commission has um, two members for to be appointed. One um, is a certified arborist, which the qualification that they need. And Ms. Lester, she's filling the office position. And the uh, CRISPR Catanza, he's filling a, a vacancy. Very good. Any Harper, seeing none, move those two forward as well, please. Okay. Under finance, uh, we have Minority Business Enterprise and Emerging Small Business Advisory Board. This is a reappointment. Charles James, and he's feeling well, being reappointed to the lender business member slot. And he's a council appointee. Very nice. Thank you very much. 
Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the board vacancies issue, unless there's other business. They go home. I thought you were going to major issue. I'm so glad to do that. <laughs> um, this meeting is adjourned. Oh, uh, this meeting is turned over to Lou Ali Brown. Lou Brown Mullen. Let me just ask you something because I no. spoke with the um, I spoke to the city attorney about um, your directive to for me to request that you receive any any presentations um, at least with a minimum of 48 hours unless mm -hmm. it's on a Friday <coughs> that Monday that you receive that 48 hours in advance. Also, you specifically stated you want to receive the budget. You want to have a line item information. When um, I spoke with the city attorney about that, and um, he had some concerns about that. You have you have the, uh, the right under the charter to demand uh, that the budget uh, be presented to you and that you get information from the administration uh, in ways that are uh, desired by you. Uh, your discussion tonight, though, is one that took place in committee. Uh, it is not a uh, it is not a it is not formal action which could only take place at a meeting. Uh, if you wish to formalize the things that you've discussed tonight, you would need to do it by motion at a regular meeting. If you want to leave it on an informal basis, uh, then you need to do nothing further tonight. I think that unless there is a different consensus on council, we'll ask nicely. And uh, if, if it turns out that it's not working, we'll bring the hammer down. He said joking. Alright, is there any other business? Alright, this meeting is adjourned. Nice meeting. Good job. Thank you.